O solitude, if I must with thee dwell, let it not be among the jumbled heap of murky buildings. Climb with me the steep, nature's observatory, whence the dell, its flowery slopes, its river's crystal swell. For solitude sometimes is best society. Conversation enriches the understanding, but solitude is the school of genius. Albert Einstein said that solitude is painful when one is young, but delightful when one is more mature. Well, as one who delights in quiet moments, I can appreciate Einstein's sentiments. Yet every day, it seems, the joys of such peaceful moments are harder and harder to find. Fortunately, here in Alabama, that best society, that school of genius, that delight of solitude is still readily available. You just have to know where to look. Hi, I'm Doug Phillips. If you enjoy what William Wordsworth referred to as the bliss of solitude, you're in luck. Because in our state, there's always a trail that'll take you there. Of course, not everyone out on the trail is seeking solitude. Some come for fellowship. Some come for the exercise. Some for a fleeting glimpse. Some to capture a glimpse. Adventure. Recreation. Meditation. Education. You don't have to have a reason to be out on the trail. Sometimes, no reason is the best reason of all. Alabama has thousands of miles of outdoor trails, and today we're going to visit as many of them as we can. We'll see how trails contribute to the history and heritage of our state. And more importantly, we'll see how they contribute to the heritage that we will leave for future generations. So join me as we hit the trail.